All right, so I flew in from Florida because um, this is Ryan McGee and this jerk actually got a hole in one and won the helicopter. Uh, unbelievable. Ryan, could you please tell them what equipment you were using and, and, and give them some points on how to get a hole in one? How to get all the more now? Yeah, expert? yeah. So, so, so it's it's always important to have a lot of fun. Uh, I recommend you use the cheapest range ball that you can. This is a, uh, a top flight XL that's got a big scratch on the side of it. Okay, that's and, good. Uh, and, and it probably uh, helped the scratch ball. It probably, it probably helped it curve right there at the end towards yeah. the hole. And uh, this is a Walmart golf club from 2000. It's a uh, Dunlop Quattro Plus. And uh, a graphite shaft? This is not. This is a steel shaft. Oh, and okay. uh, I'm steel shaft. That's, yeah, that's yeah. the point. Yeah. You know, all you guys are thinking you go out and spend. Five hundred dollars on some kind of club and get these fancy get stuff. Was it fitted to you? It was not. It was no, not. So just yeah. Scott, yeah. that's Stop. the way to do Stop. it. Stop. Stop is the way to go. All Stop. you guys are trying to win a helicopter or whatever hole in one prize you're trying to win. You know, go back to the basics. That's yeah. what you need to do. Go to Walmart or uh, looks like maybe a pawn shop. Pawn shop. Yeah. yeah. Pawn shop. Now. Good idea. Yeah. yeah. Um, and get yourself a helicopter. So yeah. Ryan, congratulations. Uh, we appreciate you going out and we like supporting the community and doing amazing things. And I guess we're gonna have to go get a, a black helicopter now yeah. for the next tournament. Yeah, All right. oh yeah. Can't Thanks wait. a lot, buddy. Thanks, Glenn. All right, man, good to see you.